Like and subscribe right now or this spider will crawl on your face when you're sleeping. There are so many incredible animals in this world and only a few of them have been discovered yet. Through advancement in science, we've successfully modified the genetics of some animals and have formed hybrids. These hybrids are formed as a result of a cross between animals of two different species. Some of these hybrid animals are quite common. You must have heard of the mule and liger. If not, they're also included in our list of 10 bizarre hybrid animals that actually exist. Stay tuned to see some of the shocking hybrids. Number 10. Zebroid A zebroid is also known as a zedonk, zebra mule, and zebrule, and they've all been bred since the 19th century. Zebroid is the offspring produced as a result of a cross between a zebra and any other equine, including horses or donkeys. Most of the time, the sire is a zebra stallion. Offspring can be produced from the hybrid of the donkey sire and the zebra dam, which are named zebra honey or dankor. Offspring production by a hybrid is rare. Zebroid is the genetic name for all zebra hybrids. The different hybrids are generally named using the portmanteau convention of sire's name plus dam's name. There is generally no distinction made as to which zebra species are used. Most of the time when zebras are used in hybridization, dwarfism and even some of the species results in infertile offspring. Examples include Zorse, Zebrule, Zonkey, Zabonkey, and Zoni. Before we move on, I've got a little challenge for you that'll take five seconds to complete. So here's the deal. You just leave a like on this video, smash that subscribe button, and hit the notification bell, and you'll get 25 years of amazing luck. Try it. It really works. Number 9. Liger The Liger is a hybrid cross between the father of lions named Panthera leo and the mother of tigers named Panthera tigris. Liger is considered to be the largest cat species on the planet. Thus, it has parents with the same genus but a different species. It is distinct from the similar hybrid Tiglon. Ligers exist only in captivity because the habitats of the parental species do not overlap in the wild. Notably, ligers typically grow larger than either parent species, unlike tiglons which tend to be about as large as a female tiger. These can have a body weight of 900 pounds and a body length of 12 to 14 feet. Ligers do enjoy swimming just like tigers and are very sociable like lions. Historically, when the Asiatic lion was prolific, the territories of lions and tigers did overlap and there are legends of ligers existing in the wild. These can run as fast as tigers, reaching the top speed of 50 miles per hour. Number 8. Wolfen A wolfen, or walfen, is an extremely rare hybrid of whale and dolphin. This hybrid is formed by the mating of a female bottlenose dolphin, scientifically named Torsiops truncates, and the male false killer whale named Pseudocorca crescidens. Although they have been reported to exist in the wild, there are currently only two in captivity, both at Sea Life Park in Hawaii. The first recorded wolfen was born in a Tokyo Sea World, but this one died after 200 days. The first wolfen in the United States who survived was Kakeimalu, which means from the peaceful. This was born at Sea Life Park in Hawaii on May 15th in the year 1985. Kike Malu, the first wolfen in captivity, proved fertile when she gave birth at a very young age. The calf died after a few days, however, and in 1991, Kike Malu gave birth once again to daughter Pohaike Aloha. For two years, she cared for the calf but did not nurse it, and Pohaike Aloha died at age 9. Number 7. Growler Bear a grizzly polar bear hybrid, also called the pizzly bear, prizzly bear, or even growler bear, is an extremely rare ursid hybrid. This hybrid has occurred both in captivity as well as in the wild. Their presence was first confirmed in 2010 by a person named David who found a creature he had never seen before. This bear was blonde with dark paws and dark eyes. David shot this bear and brought him under police custody. In 2006, a hunter found the first confirmed Peasley bear. Further confirmations were done by testing the DNA for a strange-looking bear that had been shot near Saks Harbor, Northwest Territories, on Banks Island in the Canadian Arctic. Ursid hybrids, a term that designates any hybrid of two species within the family Ursidae, include several other types of polar bear hybrids. 
These hybrids resemble both of the parents as their heads are not sleek and boxy. These hybrids are thought to have resulted due to climate change. Number 6. Beefalo Beefalo are a fertile hybrid offspring resulting from a cross between the domestic cattle named Bostaurus and the American bison named Bison Bison, also called Buffalo. These hybrids are born fertile and can live and thrive in the wild. The attempts to create such a hybrid started back in the 19th century and nearly in 1965 when the first fertile beefalo was bred successfully. The breed was created to combine the basic characteristics of both animals with a major concern for beef production, which was leaner and with a much less amount of cholesterol present in it. Beefalo are primarily cattle in genetics and appearance, with the breed association defining a full beefalo as one with bison genetics, while animals with higher percentages of bison genetics are called bison hybrids. These hybrids are proven to bear the harsh weather while providing better quantities of milk. Creating the beefalo has proven to be a serious setback to wild American bison conservation. Most current buffalo herds are genetically polluted or partly crossbred with cattle and hence are in fact beefalo. Number 5. Savannah Savannah cat is the name given to the offspring of a cross between the wild and the domesticated cat. Yes, two cats in one. The mating between a domesticated cat and a medium-sized, large-eared wild African cat results in savannah. This unusual cross between cats gained popularity among breeders at the end of the 20th century. In the year 2001, the International Cat Association accepted this hybrid as a new registered breed. Savannas are the largest domesticated cat breeds and much more social than typical domestic cats. These follow you around the house and are just like dogs in their loyalty. They can be trained to walk on a leash and even taught to play fetch. Bengal breeder Judy Frank crossbred a male serval belonging to Susie Woods with a Siamese who was a domestic cat. This mating was done to produce the first savanna cat on April 7, 1986. Frank Savannah attracted the interest of Patrick Kelly, who purchased one of Savannah's kittens in 1989. Kelly was one of the first enthusiasts who worked toward establishing a new domestic breed based on a serval domestic cat cross. He approached many serval breeders to help in the development of this new breed and finally garnered the help of breeder Joyce Schroff to work with him in taking the steps needed to have the new breed recognized. Number 4. Mule a mule is an offspring formed by mating between a male donkey named Jack and a female horse named Mare. Horses and donkeys are two different species having different numbers of chromosomes. Of the two F1 hybrids between these two species, a mule is easier to obtain than a hinny. Almost all of the male mules and most female mules are infertile. Rarely a female mule is fertile with the estrus cycle and is called a molly. Any breed of horse can be used for mule and mules are used for various jobs as jumping, racing, rodeo, wagons, carriages, and others. Mules can be lightweight, medium weight, or even, when produced from draught horse mares, of moderately heavy weight. Number 3. Camma A camma is a hybrid between a male dromedary camel and a female llama, produced via artificial insemination at the Camel Reproduction Center in Dubai. The first camma was born on January 14, 1998. The aim was to create an animal with the size and strength of the camel, but the more cooperative temperament and higher wool production of the llama. Camma can reach up to 49 or 57 inches in height, and their bodies can weigh up to 1,000 pounds, which is covered with soft fur. Camma has short ears, a long tail, and cloven hooves with no hump on the back. And now let us move on to our subscriber pick of the day. This image was sent to us by a subscriber. Similarly, if you ever wish to know more about an image you come across, just send it to us. Who knows, we might even feature it in one of our videos. Number 2. The Subscriber's Pick Our subscriber picture today shows an animal having the surface stripes like a zebra and the body of a rhino. Is this a hybrid? It doesn't seem so. It's more of a Photoshop image in which modifications are made in the body of the rhino and strips of black and white color are added on the body. Number 1. Wolf Dog A wolf dog, 
or also named a wolf dog hybrid or wolf hybrid, is a canine hybrid resulting from the mating of a wolf, including various Canis lupus subspecies, and a domestic dog, including Canis lupus familiaris. These are a mixture of both wolves and dogs. The term wolf dog is preferred by most of the animal's proponents and breeders because the domestic dog recently was taxonomically recategorized as a subspecies of wolf. In first-generation hybrids, gray wolves are most often crossed with wolf-like dogs, including German Shepherds, Siberian Huskies, and Alaskan Malamutes, for an appearance most appealing to owners desiring to own an exotic pet. Because wolf dogs are genetic mixtures of wolves and dogs, their physical and behavioral characteristics cannot be predicted with any certainty. And that concludes our list of the 10 bizarre hybrid animals that actually exist. Which of these surprised you the most? Comment down below to let us know. And before you go, don't forget to like and subscribe and click the bell icon to stay up to date with our latest videos. We'll see you next time.